Hello, my name is Martha Townsend, Executive Director of the Outdoor Circle, testifying in opposition to PLDC and the statute and the rules of the Land use laws, zoning requirements, environmental protection, these are all developed over years and years to prevent past poor decision making, such as locating incompatible land uses next to each other, like landfills next to schools, or jeopardizing our natural resources, like allowing stormwater runoff into our streams. Nothing should be exempted from these protections. They were developed over time, having recognized past mistakes and attempting to prevent them in the future. <coughs> Exempting projects from these time-tested protections is foolish. Good planning is not a burden. It is a requirement. Good public engagement is not a burden, it's a requirement. The changes made to the rules as proposed do not address many of the public concerns that have been raised throughout this entire process, from the time the public became aware of the statute now on the books to today. And many of us recall the PLDC and the end discussion about the PLDC that our public concerns would be addressed during the rulemaking process. And here we are in the rulemaking process and that's not the case. I'd like to highlight testimony of other people who have mentioned that we actually don't need the PLDC to do any of the projects that have so far been proposed. Caring for our harbors, maintaining parking lots, cleaning toilets, those kinds of things don't require special exemptions. We can fulfill the obligations of government without doing unnecessary exemptions from laws meant to protect the public's best interest. And for these reasons, the Outdoor Circle and many people here urge you to not adopt these rules uh, and are actually going to advocate for the repeal of the PLC. Thank you.